Oh, 125. Murphy's here. We're on the 125 and uh, we're gonna go ahead up to the trails. So uh, yeah I just got off the trails riding the 250. Top right of your screen if you want to see that video but uh, we're gonna take the 125 on the trails. Perfect non-trail bike. Um, real quick I just want to quickly go over. This bike is running so a little bit rich on the Pilot Jet. Uh, it's just the way I have it jetted but it's running real crispy up main or up in the main jet up high. So uh, this bike's going to sound like it's bogging down like it's running really rich down low because uh, in these trails we're going to be lugging this bike around a lot. Um, but just know it's really not that running that rich. It's just on the pilot circuit. Um, and uh, yeah, just wanted to get that out because a lot of people who aren't familiar with two strokes are going to say, oh, you're going to follow a plug. And uh, well, yeah, I'm running a little rich on the pilot. Uh, it's not to where we're going to be following anything or anything like that today. So uh, let's go ahead up to the trails. feeling but no engine braking when we let off the gas nothing it doesn't slow us down in any way this bike just requires more user input again i've said this already a lot but this bike is running rich on the pilot Pilot circuit down on the RPM. This bike is set up to be an MX bike, and that's why. But it does fine trail riding here, as you guys will ski here in a minute. Now, first part of this trail is a little more flowy. It gets more technical as we go. I should also mention, this is not a stock 125. I have changed slightly, or I've bumped up the cylinder port timing. Put a slightly higher compression head on it. And I'm running C12 for each gas. This bike really screams in the mid-range. Of course, we're not going to be riding a whole lot of it today. We're going to be just lugging it around. But it, I feel like it does have a better pickup and go in the real low end, which is what we're riding in today. Clear the bike out a little bit, but here I'm going to stop and show you guys real quick. A little bit of smoke, but it's not loaded up with pre-mix by any means, so that gargling sound you hear on low RPM, that's just because we're running here a little rich on the pilot circuit. I'm going to stop talking about that now, uh, otherwise this whole, uh, whole video is going to be me talking about jetting. So let's keep uh, cruising along. I'm not trying to set any lap times, I'm just cruising here. I'm not trying to rip up their trails either. Trail etiquette kind of thing. 
I keep going this way. I don't think I've been this way in a long time. A little bit of a branch just chilling there. No big deal. Uh oh, another branch. That's the stuff that's like really rough in that mid range. <laughs> Mid to top. It doesn't have quite as much over rev as a stock 125 would. But two ribs. Yeah, this side definitely more flowy. Definitely a little quicker. Like here we go again, you know what I mean? It's filled with so much joy and it feels so nimble like you're jumping around. Great time. Everyone needs to experience a two-stroke. <laughs> No trail bike, but it it uh, holds its own in the trails, man. It really does. And even then, I have stiffer suspension springs in this than I, than the, uh, than what comes stock in it. I have one stiffness up, one stiffness stiffer, and this is springs for front rear. And even then, the suspension still feels pretty flush. Of course, a lot of, the, of course, a lot of that is uh, the dampening of clickers, but still. Let's clear her out a little bit here, even though she's not really loaded up. Right? Yeah, you guys heard that crispy. Y'all hear that crispy? She ain't loaded up. Don't worry. As much as it may sound like it. <laughs> She ain't. And I may have someone complain about the end of breaking. 
you know, I run this thing right on the pilot. And that helps a lot because when the throttle is closed, it gives the carb or the engine a little bit more fuel. And when we're lugging around like this, we're going to have no issue with lubrication. I run 32 to 1, which is way more than enough for trail riding like this. We could probably run 50, run 50 to 1 and be just fine. For trail riding like this on a small board, two stroke, easily 50 to 1. But that's a more of a matter of your jetting than it is your premix ratios, guys. This whole video is going to be me on a jetting rant. <laughs> I'll shut up so you guys can listen to this bike. But just keep in mind, we are getting into the more technical portion. So we're going to be uh, lugging around just a little bit more. But a quick stab the clutch every now and then just helps. Yeah, it was a quick show ride on the old 125. Hope y'all enjoyed.